you guys can pause this if you want to read it. That's the recalibration tool in and uh, on the note it says make sure good batteries are in the car and the power is off. Unclip and remove the body shell from the car chassis. Insert the device into the socket on the chassis. Switch on the car. The green light will flash on and off. Position the car on track A, sec section A. Starting grid as shown. Just like this. There we go. The car must be positioned completely straight and on the track and exactly in the middle of the track. Just like shown. Press and release the device button. Green light will turn off. Wait and do not touch the car. The green light will turn on once recalibration is complete. Note, if the red light turns on, switch off the car and repeat from step 4. So, we'll click. And straight to red light. Now that is happening on both real FX cars. This is a real FX car. You can see the the chassis ends here, and you can see the, the servo in there. Now this one is a uh, an actual Hot Wheels car. You can see the different chassis here. It's uh, not exposed. Of the fit it under the plastic. But again, we'll try the recalibration here, and we push it. Green light goes out and the green light goes back on and that's your the part where it uh, tells you about the red light and repeating to step four. If if the step continues and the green light comes back on then your car is completely calibrated after that. So you're free to switch off the car and remove the device and replace the, the body shell. One car successfully calibrated.